All right, I got a question for you. How would you like to have an exciting new career path with a very, very high earning potential? It is not too late to enroll at the Stenotype Institute of Jacksonville. Thelma Gibson is back with information on how you can get started today. And she brought along Robin L. Merker, a past president of the Florida Court Reporting Association. Nice to see you, mm -hmm. as always, yeah. and nice to meet you. Nice it is so cool because you, you are so excited about this. You know how like rockers like have air guitars or whatever? I, was... I saw you doing this as somebody was, they yes. were talking over there. That's why I had to do that little thing. At the <laughs> you, I, this is really exciting for I you. I love it's, what it's I a do. fun thing. That is so awesome. So you guys have a huge celebration going on this week, actually. Tomorrow is a big event, right? Well, actually, today is the oh, big event. Oh, today is a big yes. event. Yes, but this whole week we are celebrating National Court Reporters Week just to bring recognition to the field. I love my job because I feel like I have this secret. People don't know what court reporting is, the demand, and the earning potential. So in admissions, I get to spread the word. So bring up, since you brought it up, earning potential. Um, According to the NCRA, 62000 is an average. And talking with Robin this morning, she has told me what she's made over the last 30 years. And then other people are well over six-figure incomes. It is very possible. That is so cool. Yes. And Robin, you've been doing this for 30 years. So yes. you were five. You were six, I seven wish. maybe when you started. I'm a card-carrying member of AARP. So no, I wasn't five. <laughs> How have things changed? Because we, I've seen the old stenography or whatever you call it, the machines mm -hmm. that you guys used and what they are now, it's changed a well, lot. Well, the hasn't machines, it? the keyboard has not changed. There's a few little additions, but the basic idea of how it works is there, but it's no longer mechanical. Mm -hmm. It's more than electrical. It's computerized. It has artificial intelligence. It integrates with the laptop. You could put it out on the iPad. Captioning on television is done with these right, machines. Right. And in the old days, I dictated for a typist. Wow. And now, I write, it's 99% translated, I scope it, I use a proofreader, and it's instant. I assign electronically, no more d dropping things off in parking lots. So it's wow. come a very, very long way. That's awesome. It makes it easier, too, for, for everybody, especially with learning and actually being able to get out there and into the workforce a lot Absolutely. quicker. Absolutely. So tell us about Florida Court Reporting Association. Okay, we were formed in 1960 to seek certification for court reporters because we want all court reporters held to the same standard. Over the years, we have become a major support to our students in the state. We have a mentoring program. We have a convention where court reporters who are nationally certified and state certified must have continuing education. So we offer many opportunities for training and advancement through that. We also, for the National Court Reporters Association, we're the ones that administer the speed tests. Mm. So I have a, down in South Florida, I'll be in charge of a testing center. We have a testing center in Tampa. We have a testing center up here, I believe. And we do that as a volunteer organization to support the state and to support reporters in our state. Wow. So you've been doing this for 30 years now. Yes. What you keep is your... saying that. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you've been doing it for a few, a few years now. What, what has been your favorite thing? I mean, is it is obviously like traffic things or whatever. Yeah, it's well, not so exciting, but what's I'm been I'm on fun? the civil side. I'm not a state employee. So uh. I do almost everything. And with the exception of one criminal trial, I don't do criminal. Uh. I love the fact that I get up in the morning and I'm always walking into something new. I've gone to South America for jobs. I've done high profile cases in the past, including one out of Palm Beach County, the Goodman trial, which is now on appeal, so we won't say much. But everything I do is a learning experience. I have taken a mortician and learned about embalming. I, wow. It's a little macabre, but I was fascinated. I take doctors, I take lawyers, I take dentists, everything. It's a lot so of fun. So you are learning something every time. And, and that's and the excitement. You're never bored. Never the same thing. Right. Very cool. So if somebody's watching right now, Thelma, and they want mm -hmm. to get started, and they want to get involved, what, what would you suggest to them right now? I would suggest they call us today. Um, you're going to give out our number. Come in, visit, see if court reporting is a good fit for you. And come in for the celebration. Well, that is full. We took reservations oh. up until today, and we've got full capacity, so we can't wait we can't to get come. back. You can't squeeze me in? There's not, we can't negotiate? I can squeeze you Maybe. in. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so when somebody has graduated from mm -hmm. the class, yes. and they're ready to hit the workforce, the million-dollar question, do you have job placement, and do they get jobs? Absolutely, yes. Last year's statistic, 90.9%. They're already wow. out in the field working, doing an internship, and usually that's where their job offers come from. There's always court. There's, There's always, always a demand. something going on yes. and, and whatnot. Yes. March 3rd is when your next classes begin. It so is. unlike, I hope, 
the event tonight that oh, yes. I can't go and, <laughs> and do. Can there I still sign still up? There are seats available, Nick, if you want to try becoming a court reporter. Okay. <laughs> or for anyone that's interested, call this week, come in. If you like it, we can get everything processed and start your March the 3rd. Very cool. Thank you, ladies, so Thank much you, for Nick. being You're here. Really, really sure. appreciate it. And thanks to Stenotype Institute of Jacksonville for sponsoring this segment. If you would like more information about enrolling in classes, just give them a call, 904 398-4141 or visit stenotype.edu. Stay with us. We'll be right back.